I mean, I'm a big fan of the peanut butter eggs. Yeah, just that and the mixture of the chocolate. And I mean, it's just a good, uh, yeah, I mean, not that. There he is! Get him! Hey everyone, thank you for joining us and happy Easter. We are so glad that you are here with us and I, I love Easter. I mean, it is such a great time of the year, a great holiday, if yeah. you will. I have so many great memories. You know, Chris, one of my favorite Easter traditions is getting a lot of paint, loading it up into like one of those paint guns and then just go around the neighborhood and just paint people's houses like different colors. I you know? believe I, that is a, that's not a good thing to do there, Kyle. Is that really one of the things that you do? Gotcha! What? It's an Easter gotcha. What is an Easter gotcha? An Easter gotcha is probably my favorite Easter tradition. You know, you go up Never to heard of it. Really? Yeah. Oh, we do it every single year. You know, you get your family, your friends, and then you just pull pranks on them. And you say, oh, gotcha. That's, that's what you do for Easter? That's the Easter... <laughs> yeah, so yeah. we did some more gotchas, so check these out. All right, we are here and we have some hollow chocolate bunnies. And Chris and I love them so much that we wanted to share them with some of our friends. And so we're gonna give each of our friends 10 seconds and we are gonna see who can eat the most of the chocolate bunny. So, let's do this. All right, I'm good. Oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the I can't do any of it. Gotcha! <laughs> I'm so unhappy. Wait, that doesn't count. How can barbecue sauce should not be a thing? Gotcha again! Wow, that looked amazing. It that sure looked did. like some great chocolate bunnies. And you know yeah. what? We're gonna get into some more chocolate later as we conclude our Easter candy bracket. That's right, because you voted, we get to narrow down, we got the two championship candies, don't we? Going head to head, gonna <gasps> find out which one is the best. But first, we have several things that we need to take care of. And one of those things being a very special guest is going to be coming. Uh, I, I hope you are ready. I hope you're ready to draw along and get in the real Easter theme because we have our very good friend, Mr. Rob Boss. Let's do it. Well, hello and a happy Easter to y'all. That's just a little bunny humor. I hope you're having a great time today. We're going to do a little draw along, get in the Easter spirit, and we're going to draw one of the classic Easter pieces the iconic Easter egg. And I'm sure that your drawing, your painting, is going to be excellent. That's just a little egg humor before we get started. Now I want you to grab your canvas, your paper, your wall, your neighbor's dog, whatever it is you would like to create on. Um, and always remember that the world is your canvas. Okay, and so you get whatever writing utensil you feel comfortable with, a pencil, a crayon, a pen, 
I like to use my pair of scissors here today. Now it looks like we're all set up and ready to go. So what I want you to do is make your way to the middle of your canvas. And I want you to draw, just draw a happy little oval right there. Just draw a happy little oval right in the middle there. That's nice. And there we have it. We have ourselves a happy little Easter egg. I'm sure yours is very extraordinary. Just a little egg humor. Happy Easter, y'all. Wow, man, that was some of the greatest painting I have ever seen. That guy is a are, genius. Are you serious? Yeah. I'm, I love his paintings. What was that? Who? Who's that? It's the Easter Bunny. Where the are Easter you? Bunny? I'm here. I, what, I, I'm not seeing you. Do you see the Easter I Bunny? I don't see him. What are you doing here? I'm looking right at you guys. Oh. Okay, that doesn't that answer the question of what you're doing here. Also, don't really like that. Uh, yeah. Oh, I'm just here, you know, to play a little game. Well, what are, what are we gonna do? Yeah. What, what, what you guys are gonna be looking for some eggs. There is a special egg at okay. the end of this Easter egg hunt. Yeah, I mean, is there something in this egg that makes it special? Is it well, like giant? Well, it would be called a special egg for no reason, Kyle. Wow. There's something special with that egg. I'm, I'm excited. So we're going to go on this hunt and it's going to lead us to a special egg. There's a lot of questions that I have right now. Uh, are we just, just the two of us or is yeah. it like what's going on? I mean there's some people out there. Uh, what that people? are going to be what playing people? this game? Who are we playing this game with? Easter egg hunters. Wow, okay. So we, we get to the special egg and then what happens? We'll see. Let's, Let's go, go on, on a hunt. hunt. There he is! Get him! Ah! What are you doing? What are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I'm looking for the special egg. Me too. What do you mean you're looking for the egg? You sent us on the hunt. Yeah, but I lost it. Okay, so what were we going to do if we found the egg? I don't know. You want to hang out? Alright, over there. I sat on something. Yeah. What? You, you sat had on it, it the whole time? I left the dent. Give me that. What's in it? It's special, be careful. Yeah, special. You lost it. Oh, more candy. Oh. That's what I got. Here you go, guys. Hey. Oh. Thanks. Oh. Just for my friends. Yeah. Just for friends.
Has there ever been something that you've been disappointed with? I know I've been disappointed. One Easter, my parents promised me they could meet a life-size Reese's peanut butter filled egg. And all I got was a box of peeps. But today, we're gonna hear about something that doesn't disappoint us. Actually, not just something, but someone. We don't want you to ever be disappointed with Easter. You may not get the gift that you want, but the story of Easter is one that can change our lives forever. Maybe you heard Easter being called Resurrection Sunday. Resurrection means coming back to life. You see, this week, 2,000 years ago, Jesus gave his life for us or on the cross. When he died on the cross, Jesus paid the penalty for all of our sins and mistakes. But the reason we call it Resurrection Sunday is that he didn't stay dead. God rose him from the dead to demonstrate that he really is God. And what he says can be trusted. When Jesus rose from the dead, he first appeared to Mary in the garden. She didn't recognize him at first, but as soon as he said her name, she knew who it was and felt peace. Then later, Jesus appeared to his closest friends and said to them, peace be with you. That's the message of Easter. That is what is so important about this day. Jesus is more powerful than death and his promises can be trusted. He promised to bring us peace. And he did. Through Jesus, we can be made right with God. And that's true peace to know that we can spend forever with God in heaven because of Easter Sunday. Because of Jesus, we can live in peace today and every day. Because he rose again, we know Jesus has the power to save us. Read the story of Jesus in the book of John and discover this kind of peace for yourself today. You are loved. You are awesome. And we hope you have a great Easter. Wow, that was great. And you know what? Jesus really does give us peace. And we hope that you have a peaceful and a great rest of your Easter or whenever you are watching this. We are really excited that you chose to join us today. You're definitely right, Chris. But you know what? We can't leave without finishing off the Easter candy bracket. That so, is right. We've got the number one seed coming out of the Shamrock Shake bracket. Give it up for... The Reese's Peanut Butter A. You got him, Chris? There we go. Look at that. No surprise. No, no surprise really. at all. Like, you no. voted overwhelmingly. Well, you know what? Favor. It was kind of close with the Hello Bunny. It, I mean, it, it, was, it was a little bit, you know. And you know what? They are going up against our number two seed, the Starburst Jelly Beans right here. And uh, you know what? We... Ooh, a little variety this time. We do have variety because we wanted to, you know, give you kind of an educated guess or uh, uh, just an informed decision as you vote on things. And so we have multiple colors. So we have a little variety over here with some colors, but then we thought we'd, we just, maybe just because we wanted to, but we wanted to have some variety here with the Reese's Bunnies. So we're gonna, you know, I think for for science sake, and for uh, just making for an informed decision, hard. Okay. I know it's gonna be all solid peanut butter, but it's not. It's got chocolate within it. I got a lot of chocolate in that one bite. You gotta get through. Kind you of eat top. half the bunny. God wish. <sighs> Give Oops. me an idea how to open it. Let's see here. Yes, I do know how to open. Wow, so we have a couple uh, of colors here we that got, we're gonna try. Yeah, we got oh, reds, we tried that before. Uh, <laughs> got a green. Orange. Oh, that's good. And I see a yellow one up here that I'm gonna try. That's really good. We need you to vote for the Starburst jelly beans or the Reese's peanut butter eggs. It all comes down. Eat. It all like comes down to this. Too. It's up to you. Which is your favorite? Is your favorite? Starburst jelly beans. Hopefully, you get to eat more than us. Sorry, Chris. Yeah, that was an accident. Well, I forgive cool. you. These are two very different arenas here. You could say two different brackets they came from. It's the best huh? of both worlds, yeah. We're gonna see the winners We're next not gonna week. decide, Chris. We're not gonna decide. We don't get to vote. We don't we get don't. to vote. It's a sad truth to what is happening it's not right up now. To us. 
It's not up to us, but it's up to you. So we need you to vote. Comment on this video. Let us know, or find us on Facebook, and you can vote there in the polls. Let it, just show all the options. Very good. And so you can let us know what it is, and then you can tune in next week to see what the winner is, what you selected. So after you vote, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Don't miss out on anything we have going on coming up. Yeah, so much fun stuff happening. And lastly, happy Easter. Happy Easter. Enjoy, I know it looks excellent. <laughs> Actually have so, an Easter Bunny, some Easter Bunny ears on the Star Wars. I didn't notice that before. Wow. Yeah, they do. So that's cool. And then we <laughs> <laughs> Happy Easter, y'all.